Hello, Andrea. Good evening. If you are over there, she's a pray. Yeah, casi vamos a comenzar clase, but we have like two minutes. So you relax. Hello, Marlon. Good evening, Marlon. Good evening, teacher. How are you doing? Good? Uh, good, I'm great. Thank okay. you. Okay, okay, that, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Okay, Um. so uh, I, I was going to ask you something. Did you go to the Iron Maiden concert some years ago? Yes, uh, I, I, I went uh, here in El Salvador and yeah. to Costa Rica in 2008. Too. Really, uh, I, I couldn't go to Costa Rica. My uncle uh, was, was to that, well, uh, he went to that concert. I couldn't go because of my job, but uh, in Costa Rica, there, well, that, that is a, a nice country because uh, a lot of, well, good bands go there first and then come yes. to El Salvador, right? Yes, yes, yes. And so that's it. So uh, what do you think, what concert was better for you here in El Salvador or in Costa Rica? No, 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 definitely in Costa Rica. Yes, uh, people say that. People say that that uh, there was was better that the concert. Yes. Even in Costa Rica, there was I think Roy Waters. He he was there. Yes. And Cannibal Corpse. A lot of uh, good bands. Yes, yes, yes. So, so okay. I, I I saw Cannibal Corpse here in El Salvador. All right. Yes. So uh, mm -hmm. as I told you, first they go to Costa Rica and then come here to El Salvador. Okay. Yes, but that's nice. Uh, and uh, related to the kiss, uh, the last year it was supposed to have like, like that concert, right? <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, I but, was but. I was planning to go, but cancel. Me too. <laughs> yes, okay. But that is the last tour, the último tour que tienen. They say sí, like, I, um, right? Sí, uh, algo así escuché. I I heard heard. Yeah, I heard something yeah. like that. Something, something like, like that. that. Yeah. Well, maybe, maybe we can see kids next year or, or maybe, this, maybe, maybe. That's it. Sí, sí, sí. Okay. Eh, okay, Megadeth también aquí en El Salvador. Ah, yes, I went to, to mega concert and, and, and even uh, Sepultura. But I was, sí. I was very young. Yes, I was sí, in sí, high sí. school. Yes, but <laughs> here in El Salvador, uh, maybe in the past we didn't, talk, we didn't think about good bands can come. No pensamos que pudieran venir buenas bandas. But sí, sí, sí. Yeah, good bands. So we have history. Tenemos historia, ya. Yeah? Yes. Perfect, Marlon. So let's see, Andrea. Te estaba clamando, Andrea. Como que si fuera genio de la lámpara hace rato, mira. Mira, y todo. OK, I can hear you. Hello. Hi. Mm -hmm. Hi. Sí. Hoy sí. Es que me tengo que levantarme un, un momentito. Ok. Mm -hmm. Yo dije, Andrés, ya me dejen visto. Dije. Mala, <laughs> no, mala. No, teacher, I'm here. Ok, I'm here. Ok. How are you, Andrea? Friday, viernesito, sí. Friday. Yeah. Eh, been... Perfect. Ok, perfect. Ok, mm -hmm. good. Are you working tomorrow? Are you going to work tomorrow? All the day. All the day. Okay, but well, remember on Saturday night ya te puedes escapar sábado en la noche, wherever, donde quiera que quiera yes. decir, okay? okay, good, that's nice. Let's listen to Claudia. Hello, wow, fancy, hello, so teacher. so fancy. Hello, Claudia. Oh, <laughs> okay. the yeah, uniform, very fancy. You look like a, a lawyer, pero es abogada. Me vas, a, me, me vas a divorciar. Okay. So, um, well, um, how are you tonight, Claudia? I'm great. You're great. Okay. Good. Are you Are you going to work tomorrow? Yes, all day. All day, similar yes. to Andrea. Okay. Yes. Well, that happens. A veces así pasa. So let's listen to Diana. Hello, Diana. Hi. 
Hi, how are you tonight? Mm. More or less. More or less. Are you going to work tomorrow? No. No, bye. Yeah. <laughs> what else do you want from this life? ¿Qué más quieres de esta vida? No, estoy incapacitada por eso. Oh, really? Uh, what? Uh, do you have the flu? ¿Tiene gripe? Or do you have headache? Dolor de cabeza? Fever? Eh, reacción. reacción ¿Estás enamorada o what? No. Ah, really? Bueno, ah. sí, pero no. Oh, ok, thank you. For that information. No, eso. Ok, so, um, when did you have the vaccine? ¿Cuándo tuviste la vacuna? Today. Okay. Yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yesterday. Yesterday. Maybe, okay, maybe those symptoms are like strange. Maybe you will have another yeah. baby. I don't know. Everything mm -hmm. can, everything is possible in this life. Okay, uh, <laughs> Diana, espero que te mejores. I hope you get Thank better. You. Okay, Dora, hello, Dorita. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Wow, what a big TV you have in the back. Tienes ahí atrás de ti. Wow, nice TV. So how are you, Dora? Very well. Very well. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Susie, why so serious? Tengo mm, sueño. Yeah, <laughs> me too. Por dos. Okay. Ah, pues ya te voy a preguntar <laughs> algo. Espera, no, te voy a hacer un par de preguntas. Que te van a quitar el sueño. Okay. I'm going to ask you a question. Cuando tenga así, tengo un par de preguntas que, que aquí tengo un ratito el sueño. Espérate, ya vos sos la primera. Okay. So, um, let's listen to Carmen. Hello, Carmen. Hello, teacher. Okay, how are you doing tonight? Ah, uh, so, so. So, so, okay. I like your blouse. It is black, right? Black, yes. Black, okay, nice. You look like rocker. <laughs> like, like Marlon team. Come on, come on. Team de Marlon, okay, good. Okay, um, here we have also Carla. Good evening, Carla. Hi, teacher. Hello. How are you tonight? Um, good. Good. Okay, that's perfect. Leslie, hello. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello. How are you tonight? All right. All right. Okay, you're all right. Well, I like to hear that. Thank you. And Judith, are you there? Hello there. Hi, teacher. Okay. Uh, at home? Is that in class? Are you at home? Uh, see, yes. Yes, yes. Okay, well, perfect, perfect. And what about uh, Nancy? Que ya se me escondió. Nancy? Are you in a party? Estás en una fiesta? Hey, es que estoy teniendo problemas. Oh. Ahorita me conecté con el teléfono. No me puedo conectar con la Zoom. Really? Okay, okay. We're going to wait. Ahí vamos a esperar. Okay. Aquí para después. José Lara, hello. Good evening. Y esa gringa que apareció ahí, dije. Ok. Eh, José Lara, hello. hello. Hello, José. Hello. Are you driving? ¿Vas manejando? Or are you yes, uh, en unos 40 minutos. Ok, 40 minutos. Ok. Uh, just let me know when you are at home, ok? Me avisa cuando okay. estás en Ok, good. Nancy, ¿qué pasó con esa foto? Yes. How fancy, elegancia. Como un modelo se veía, se está revelando. <risa> es que tenía problemas para conectarme. Creo que es otra cuenta que tenemos. Ok. Ok, we're going to wait for you. Ok, te vamos a esperar. Con la cachatea con el novio. Damn. Mejor ni pregunto qué tipo de chat. Ok, so we're going to start with this class. Um, by uh, saying the, the content, the main content is vocabulary practice. So we're going to practice a lot and make a, well, we're going to have a, a short or a brief review of what we have studied. De lo que hemos estudiado, vamos a tener como una revisión. Recuerden que hoy deben terminar las tareas. Please, 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 my friend. Yo sé que algunos se les ha olvidado y otros que están súper adelantados, súper, hiper, mega, extra, ultra adelantados. But some others you need to finish uh, now. Eh, recuerden que pueden eh, adelantarse si gustan, ¿verdad? Y pueden hacer, eh, desarrollar lo, los, los ejercicios las veces que ustedes quieran y va a mejorar su nombre, ¿ok? 
So if I had one superpower, I would choose, choose, se parece como select, okay? Select, okay? So let's talk about superpowers, okay? Talking about superpowers, we have here some options. Y sí, lo siento porque pues ya un poquito tarde les mandé la, la, la actividad. Yo dije, se van a enojar, güey. Porque, pero bueno. Contento porque no nos iba a mandar. No, no, pues, pues no celebren antes de tiempo. No, no, no celebren. Consejo de la vida. Nunca celebren antes de tiempo. Ok. So, eh, if I had one, les voy a decir algo más, pero no. If I had one superpower, entonces sí, relájate. <ríe> si tuviera un superpoder, imagínense, a superpower, what would you choose? ¿Qué elegiría? Entonces, I would choose invisibility. Imagine, to be invisible, nobody will see you, nadie lo vería. Mm, interesting. To read people's mind, yo sé que las mujeres quisieran esto totalmente. To read people's mind, leer la mente de las personas. Yes, you do. Si quieren, no lo nieguen. Okay. Mind control, o quizás este, control mental, right? Why not? Controlar, you can control your boss, controlar su jefe. You can, you can control your colleagues. Yes. Pueden tenerlo como esclavos. A okay. teacher. No, 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 no aplica para mí. Okay. So, mind control. Mind control. X-ray vision. Esa quizás. Mm, es muy peligrosa. X-ray vision. Immortality. If you want to live like 1,000 years. Si quieren vivir mil años. Como Matusalem. Okay. Um, flight or flight. Fly es vuelo, pero fly es volar. Eh, imagine you can fly, and I'm not talking about marijuana, I'm talking about real superpower. You can fly from your house to your work. Imagine no traffic, no gasoline. Okay, you can save a lot of money. Yeah, good. Pueden cobrar por el, por el viajecito también. Okay, so absorbing power. Absorbing power, yeah. yeah. Yes, a veces pasa. Normalmente, um, eh, la gente elige quizás lo, lo, lo más principal, but absorbing power, it's, it's like another interesting. Regeneration, like Wolverine. Okay, so you can regenerate. Okay, se pueden regenerar. You can look younger, podrían verse más jóvenes. Like 25, like 20 years old, okay, like 80, 18. No, 80, 80, 18. So the transportation. I think teletransportation is one of the best because you can imagine you wake up early because you want, you have to travel from your house to your work. So you take around one hour or one hour and a half or maybe two hours traveling. I solo nasi que a la parte del trabajo vive. She like, she opens the door and she's a, at work, ya tienen el trabajo. But the rest of mortals, el resto de mortales, we have to, we, we, we have to wake up early. Tenemos que levantarnos temprano. Super strength, super fuerza, super speed, like flash. And time travel, this is really interesting, time travel. So you can go back in time, pueden viajar en el tiempo, and to have better decisions, or to bet, o pueden apostar. Okay, no, eh, no es tan moral eso. Okay, so let's listen to Susi para que ponga activa como el café. So, ya estoy activa, ya estoy activa. No, no, ya te voy a preguntar, no, no, ya te dije. Pero... Okay, Susi. Okay, I will choose teletra, teletra, eh, teletransportation. Teletransportation, okay, yes, I think it is, uh, you can travel to different places. Imagine your boyfriend says, I am in the, I am at work, baby. Estoy en trabajo, quiero ver. No. And you can find it y lo encuentras en la iglesia. Okay. So, teletransportation. Good. Now let's listen to Claudia and then Marlon. Ajá, Claudia. Contanos, tell us, tell us. No tell us, tell us. Okay. I will show um, to read people's memes and teletransportation. Uno estoy diciendo, Claudia Do. Ah, no, tú. <laughs> Claudia, como que estamos en el mercado. Okay. 
Bien, dos por uno, la nevería. Ok, to read people's mind, leer la, 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 la mente. And the other two, transportation. También teletransportarse. Yes. yes. Ok, Claudia quiere controlar el mundo. Ok, Marlon, then Andrea. Uh, if I had one superpower, I would choose uh, re re regeneration. Regenerate. You can regenerate your hair, right? Your long hair. Yes. Yes. Okay. Wow. <laughs> like Rapunzel. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Good. And what about who's next? Carmen. Then Diana. Okay. One superpower. I would choose flight. Flight. Or you can fly, yes. Imagine you, you can fly to another country. Yeah, in the same day or I don't know, to your job or to visit your grandparents. Yeah, why not? Or to visit the project. Visitar los proyectos. <laughs> okay, so nice, Carmen. Diana and then Dora. Okay, hi. Tranquila, uh, <laughs> If I had one superpower, I would choose teletransportation. Teletransportation. Um, teletransportation, okay. Yes. Where do, would you like to transport uh, mainly? Principalmente, para donde? Te, que, te gustaría teletransportar? Para el trabajo. <laughs> Ajá, okay. Only to the work? Mm, Sentate claro. Okay, yeah, and you live, where do you live, I'm sorry? Um, yes, 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 you take like one, two hours or one hour and a half? Um, two hours. Two hours, yes, two hours. Yes, I know. Puede dormir dos horas más. Okay, and Dora, Dora, and then Carla. I go choose super speed. Super speed. Yes. Para, para ganar las costas. Okay. Yes, uh, imagine you can go to every place or you can do a lot of things at home or at work. And you can save time. Puedes ahorrarte mucho tiempo de tu vida. Okay. Yes, why not? Okay, Carla, uh, your turn. What superpower would you choose? Carla. Okay, I think she's going to connect later. Um, Judis, Judis, and then Leslie. Okay, Judis, tell me. Okay. I will choose, choose fly. Okay, flight, yes. That's one uh, very important. You creo que todos hemos querido experimentar eso, yes. And a good experience, why not? Okay, Leslie, your turn, and then, and then after, Mm -hmm. Alex. Yeah. Hello. Sí. Yeah. If I had a superpower, um, the mystic. I would choose invisibility. No, mystic. Uh, the the los X Men. Ah, change appearance. Cambiar la apariencia. <laughs> Sí. Y esta Leslie me salió más avanzada. Ok, change the appearance. Yes, Mystic. Mystic eh, has uh, that power. Yes, very interesting. Ah, thank you, Leslie. A new superpower. Thank you. Se le va a parecer como la ex. Sí, como la ex para ver. ¿Te acordás cuando, cuando te acordás cuando me escribías? Ok, so um, let's listen now to Alex and then we go with César, si está por ahí. Ok, Alex. It, I had one superpower. I would choose. I would choose uh, regeneration. Regeneration, ok. Regeneration. Ok. De cualquier herida no te afectaría. Anyone, no problem for you. Te podría ver más joven, de 15 años. <laughs> ok. <laughs> uh, yes, thank you. Ok, that's good. César, are you over there? Está por ahí, César. Hello, César. Okay, maybe he's going to connect later. So I'm going to start this first. Okay. So thank you for all your opinions. As always, uh, it is very important to know what do you think about any topic. So 
um, here we have like, uh, uh, how to use preposition sign, tenemos on, in, at, right? Tenemos on, in, at, and it is uh, quite easy, de verdad, un tanto fácil, que lo, los, los estudiamos ayer, ¿verdad? On Saturday, on January 23rd, on Monday, on February, on Wednesday. Y tenemos in, in May, in 2018, in the summer, in the morning, or at, at 2.30, at noon, at night, and at midnight, okay? And here we have also this, uh, like, mail. Hicimos este correo, right? So uh, we're going to start, vamos a... Uh, pues, nuevamente vamos a practicarlo. But now um, Diana is going to help me and then Nancy. Ok, Diana. Tenemos acá from significa de, to, para. Ok, subject es como pues el, el tema. El objetivo. La, sí, el objetivo es la razón por la que lo escribes, ¿verdad? So, new products presentation, que es el, eh, la presentación de un nuevo producto. Ok, so Diana, hello Fátima. Hello, Fatima. Are you busy? Busy. busy on Monday afternoon? Do you know about the new product that the company launches? Thank you. Launches. Sí. Launch significa lanzar. Lun, o sea, si solo lleva la U, launch es como se llama almuerzo. Pero como lleva a launch, launch es lanzar. Entonces, launches. Esta tercera persona porque está hablando de la compañía. Okay. So, okay. there's a presentation. Vamos con Nancy. And after Nancy, we're having Carla. Okay, Nancy, there's. There's a presentation at Boris. And it sounds very interest, interesting. Interesting. Interest. In, interesting. Interest. No, no, no. Okay. Mm -hmm. It starts at 6 and 30. Thank you, thank you. Ok, vamos, aquí vamos a poner a Susi para que se ponga más activa como el marihuana. Ok, so I work, I work, y después va a I work until 50.45. Five. Ah, perdón, sí, 5, 5, 5. 5.45. But, but, I, but I can meet you. At 6 a.m., the corner of First Avenue in May Street. Yes, on the corner. Yes. Thank you, Carla. Your turn. What do you think? Okay, Carla, you go. What, what do you think? There are not their presentation, but but, but will be. Mm -hmm. Mm. Sería on, in, at. On. ¿Cuál? On. No, aquí sería in March. In March, in on March, Sunday. On Sunday. On Sunday. And I. And, and I can't, can't. That day. Can't in that. That day. Ok, that's good. That day. Ok, good. Bien, aquí tenemos. Um, tenemos. Uh, you remember? We started this, ya estudiamos eso. Positive sentence, I am happy. Aquí podemos decir, I am happy too, ¿verdad? Es como el mismo de me too. But we can say also, so am I, ¿verdad? Como el, eh, so am I, so do I. Se recuerdan, ¿verdad? Que, que, que si lo estudiamos, so am I, so do I. O el me too, o el, I am happy too. Eso es para decir yo también, ¿verdad? Ahora, ah, también les di un ejemplo de, uh -huh, lo de I love you, uh -huh, I am, y todo eso. But, pero si tenemos una oración negativa y we have a negative sentence, we're going to use neither. Vamos a utilizar neither o vamos a utilizar either. Ya le doy un par de ejemplos. So the negative sentence is I am not happy. I am not happy. Neither am I. O pueden decir I am not happy either. Neither significa tampoco. Ok, tampoco. So. Aquí tengo los ejemplos, ¿verdad? El, ese mismo ejemplo lo tengo acá. So, ways to say yo tampoco. Because yesterday we studied yo también. Me too, so do I, so am I, or I am happy too, for example. But in here we're going to study eh, yo tampoco. En, así que en este caso vamos a estudiar eso lo, de, lo del yo tampoco. 
And here we have the two words. Tenemos las dos palabras that are very important. Either and neither. And I'm going to use just bold. So I can... Okay. So, si utilizamos either, sería así. I am not happy. I am not either. Okay. Ambas significan tampoco. Entonces sería así. Yo no estoy feliz. Ah, yo no estoy feliz tampoco. O I am not happy either. Okay. Eh, también podemos, eh, also we can say, I don't love you. Por ejemplo, imagínense cuando van a cortar a alguien. Okay. Porque las mujeres cortan a los hombres. Okay. I don't love you. I don't either. Yo tampoco. I don't love you either. Si se dan cuenta acá, lo único es que esta parte se le ha agregado acá. ¿eh? I am not either. ¿ver? Solo para completar la oración. Pero pueden decir, I am not either or I don't either. ¿Verdad? Cualquiera. Estas son bien comunes. Esta and this. Okay. They are very common. Son bastante comunes. Porque son cortas. But you can say the other way. You also can say the other way. También pueden decir de otra manera. Now, we go with neither. Either, neither. Either, neither. Se pronuncia igual solo que aquí está yo una N. So, este se parece al so am I. And solo que en lugar de so, instead of so, we use neither. Okay? En lugar de decir so am I, decimos neither am I. Or neither do I. For example, I am not happy. The same examples that we started yesterday. I am not happy. Neither I am. Neither am I. Sorry. I don't love you. Neither do I. Es como que decir, so do I. O so am I. Solo que aquí vemos, neither am I. Neither do I. Y hay una forma. Esa es la forma super informal y corta. Es como el me too. Decir, neither me. Y esto aplica para todo. Es como el me too. Aplica para todo. Entonces, neither me. Aplica para todo. Ok. So this is important in case a person is talking about um, different opinions about the reality in the country or opinions or ideas related to the, the enterprise you're working for. Si están hablando de la empresa, la empresa necesita mejorar eso, la empresa está bien acá o no está bien. You can say, ah, ah que no piensen igual, ¿verdad? O que si no vas a hacer tal cosa. I'm not going, ah, ah, pueden decir, I don't like to work extra hours. No me gusta trabajar horas extra. You can say, oh, neither do I. Neither me. O pueden decir, I don't either. Okay? O pueden decir, I am not happy in this enterprise. No estoy feliz en esta empresa. I am not either. I am not happy either. O oh, neither am I. Okay? Sé que es un poquito confuso, pero si ustedes quieren pueden tomar una captura. ¿Verdad? Si gusta. Por la, por la cuestión de los ¿qué? De, de, de las de vocabulary, de las oraciones pero si ya lo copiaron, excelente if you uh, already took notes perfect, perfect, ok so I'm going to say some sentences and you tell me ustedes me van a decir cualquiera de estas ¿no? pueden decir cualquier de esta pueden decir esta or this and this whatever you want to use ok ok, we start with Susana. And then Leslie. I am not in love. I am not either. Okay. Let's take a question. Leslie, I don't like vegetables. I don't like vegetables. I don't like vegetables. No sé. Either. Either. Ajá, uh -huh, either, either. I don't like vegetables either. Either. Okay, good. Now we go with Diana, then Nancy. Diana, I am sick. Uh, I am not sick. No estoy enfermo. I am not sick. Mm, neither am I. Okay, good. Nancy, I don't drink coffee. Uh, I don't. I don't drink coffee. Uh, neither me. Mm -hmm, me había confiado. Okay. Marlon. 
I don't like reggaeton. Mm, I don't either. Ah, you like reggaeton? No, okay. <laughs> I don't like either. Okay, perfect. And what about Claudia? I don't like dancing. I don't like either. Dancing okay. either. <laughs> Aunque sé que si te gusta. A Dora no le voy a decir eso. Le voy a decir otra cosa. Dora, I don't like horchata. I don't like horchata either. Okay, good. Okay, um, now we go with Andrea. Andrea, I don't have kids. I don't either. Okay, but you want, I know you want. Okay, mm -hmm. Alex, uh, your turn. I don't have a, a motorcycle. Near the way. Okay, perfect. Do this. I am not a singer. Mm, neither do I. I am not singer. Am. I am neither. Uh -huh. I am not. I am not either. I am not here. Okay, Christian. Hello, Christian. Good evening. ¿Cómo estás, Christian? Hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, good evening. Good evening. Did you did you saw the, the explanation? ¿Viste la explicación de este tema, de este temita? Eh, ya un poco al final. Okay. Vamos a ver una fácil. I don't like I don't like tequila. Uh, I don't like tequila either. Okay, perfect. Good, good, good. Okay, so uh, here we have, a, this is really important. Es importante que no le guste tequila. No, tequila is good. Okay, so we have nouns and verbs. Estas son las mismas palabras. This, these are the same words, but with different pronunciation. If you see capital letter, si ven la letra mayúscula, it's because in there, you can find the accent. Ahí puede encontrar el acento o la fuerza de voz. Ok. Y vamos a poner un ejemplo bien sencillo. Tenemos acá. Tenemos record. Y aquí record. Record versus record. Cuando decimos record, eh, pues se refiere a una grabación, se refiere pues, a algunas notas que han tomado y todo eso. En cambio, record significa grabar. Eh, tomar notas, eh, ¿verdad? Todo lo, lo que tiene que ver con, con, con ese aspecto. Aquí tenemos increase. Y aquí, increase. Increase. Y la otra, increase. Eh, aquí es incremento. Y aquí es incrementar. Aquí es aumento. Aumentar. ¿Ok? Recuerden que los verbos terminan en ar, er, ir, or, ur. Uh, ar, er, ir. Perdón. Ar, er, ir. Ya estoy directo. Entonces, aquí ve grabar, a incrementar. Tenemos update y luego update. Update versus update. Entonces tenemos aquí que update significa eh, pues actualización y update actualizar. Nombres y verbos o sustantivos y verbos. Project. Proyecto. Project. Y luego tenemos project que es proyectarse. Project versus project. Tenemos Insult versus insult. Insult versus insult. ¿Verdad? Insulto versus insultar. Ahora vamos a hacer un ejemplo bien sencillo. No nos va a tomar más de dos minutos. All the words in Spanish has accent, but not all of, eh, in any language. Todas las palabras en cualquier idioma tienen acento. But not all of them have tilde. No todas tienen tilde y siempre con, con, confundimos la tilde con el acento. La, la tilde es solo la línea. Ok, entonces, por ejemplo, café tiene el acento en la última vocal. Café. No dice café. Si decimos gato, por ejemplo, tiene el acento en la A, ¿verdad? Gato. No decimos gato. En el caso de carro, también tiene el acento en A. Sería carro, no carro. ¿Verdad? Entonces, necesito que me elijan cualquiera de todas estas. Vamos a practicar, ¿ok? Record, record. Increase, increase. Update, update. 
project, project. Insult, insult. Okay, and this is important because sometimes we may mix or we confuse nouns and verbs. So the idea is not so clear and you have to express clear ideas. It tienen que pues, expresar eh, ideas pues, claras. Otra vez, record, record. Increase, increase. Update, update. Project, project. Insult, insult. Okay, I'm going to check the attendance list. Reviso lista de asistencia y elegen uno, okay? Later, well, I'm going to ask you later. Okay, Andrea, hello, Andrea. Hi, teacher. Okay, okay Alberto Soriano is not here, so Carmen, I know it. she's uh, here. Ya se, se lo un momento. Cesar, hello, Cesar. Okay, uh, Claudia, hello, Claudia. Hi, teacher. Hello, uh, Christian. Present. Thank you. Um, Alex. Present. Hello, Diana. Present. Nice. Dora. Present. Okay, Ever. Ever is not here. Okay, um, Javier. No. Uh, Jose Fajardo. No. Uh, Jose Miguel. Uh, right. Okay, um, Carla. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, uh, Kelvin, not here. Leslie, hello, Leslie. Present, teacher. Thank you. Marlon. Present. Hello, Nancy. Present. Okay, Susana. Present. Susie and Judith. Present. Okay, we start uh, with Diana and then Andrea. Okay, Diana, select one. For example, record, record, increase, increase. Mm -hmm. um, increase, increase. Okay, increasing. Okay, thank you. Andrea, then Susie. Project, project. Okay, project, project. Project. Yeah, thank project, you. Project, project. Thank you. Susie, then Leslie. Update, update. Good. Okay, thank you. Leslie, then Nancy. Record. Record. Okay, good. Nancy? In cruz. In cruz. But to cruz. <laughs> okay. Increase, increase. Yo sé que estás enamorada, Nancy, pero relájate. Okay. Increase, increase. Vamos otra vez, Nancy. Increase, increase. Increase. Mm -hmm. Increase. Increase. Ah, yes. Perfect. <laughs> Ya ves lo que hace el amor. Ok. Perdón, um, teacher, ¿qué dijo que significa esa palabra? Increase. Aquí es incremento y aquí incrementar. O también puede ser aumento. Aumentar. Ok. So, uh, now we go with Dora and then Carla. Ok, Dora. Insul, insol. Thank you. Carla and then we go with uh, Judith. Project. Project. Yes, nice. Do this and then Alex. Increase, increase. Okay, increase, increase. Yes, increase, increase. Okay, uh, we go with Alex, then Andrea. Record, record. Record. Ah, ya pasaste, Andrea. Ya me hiciste la cara. Okay, tranquila. Okay, Claudia and then Marlon. Projects, projects. Good. Marlon, you go. Uh, increase, increase. Perfect. Okay, good. So now here we have and uh, we have a speaking activity, and so we're going to uh, ask uh, five questions. Vamos a hacer seis preguntas. Con what? Con when? Con where? Why? Which? Who? Okay. I'm going to to get uh, all the students in pairs. Voy a poner a todos los estudiantes en parejas mientras me hacen estas preguntas. Whatever question you want. Cualquier pregunta que quieran. If you want, you can ask easy questions. Okay? What? 
utilizando what, utilizando when, utilizando where, why, which, who. ¿Ok? Con cualquiera de estas. Así que ya saben, what, ya saben qué significa qué. Um, when significa cuándo, where, dónde, why, por qué, which, cuál. Cuando pueden utilizar which para dos opciones. Which do you prefer? Um, donuts or María Luisa. ¿Qué prefieres, donuts o María Luisa? Or which do you prefer? Um, yep. Rice pupusas or corn pupusas? Pupusas de arroz o pupusas de maíz? What do you prefer? Horchata or cebada? Yeah. Whatever you want. What do you prefer? To work in the morning or to work in the afternoon at night? Okay. So now that you are ready, I'm going to... Okay. Please take notes. Solo tomen nota de sus preguntas. Cuando les conteste su compañero... Eh, Solo voy a necesitar una, digamos, un tipo de información. No es necesario que, que copien todas las respuestas, ¿verdad? Ok, so, um, that's it. Mientras, while you are creating the equations, mientras hacen las preguntas, I'm going to sign the, the groups. Okay, see you in a couple of minutes. Porque, porque... <risa> las tiene completas es que me siguen faltando dos todavía pero mm. vaya hagamos las que tengamos vaya. ay André, ay, André. <risa> mm. 
Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Bye, Ayola. Bye. Yes. This is the real. Okay. Bye. Chevrolet has shared his birthday. Okay. On December 2. I see. Sí. Sí. Two. December 2. Okay. Sí. Okay. Chevrolet. From San Miguel, ¿verdad? Sí. Y sería, así contestaría usted. She lives from San Salvador. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. And... Una con what? Teacher, ya que está aquí. Uh -huh. Vamos a hacer las seis preguntas. Se las vamos a preguntar al, al compañero. Uh -huh. Solo una. Y, y a usted solo le vamos a decir una. Sí, solo una. Por ejemplo, si le preguntas, what's your mother's last name? ¿Cuál es el apellido de tu mamá? Uh -huh. O what's your mother's last name? Entonces, ahí esa, esa información, si quieres, me da. Porque te voy a decir, ok, tell me about Nancy. Y me va a decir, ah. Her mother's last name is Acosta. Ah, oh. okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Para que no estén copiando tanto, lo que me interesa es que digan las preguntas, ¿ok? Oh, That's okay. most important. Okay. Okay. Nos falta una con what's, Hello, ¿qué pasó, Dianita? Cuéntame, cuéntame tu tragedia. No, esto ya nos contamos, la, ya nos ya. contamos. Sí, <ríe> ya la teníamos lista. Wow, qué bárbaro, <ríe> qué bárbaro. Ok, good. La vieja confiable. What's on you see? La vieja confiable. Teacher, otra vez. Ah, me confundí. <risa> Por eso le digo, la vieja confiable. What's on you see? Uh -huh. What, where, when? When, Fanta? When is your birthday? Oh, my birthday is August 10th. On, on August 10th. 10th. Mm -hmm. Bye. Okay, guys, so let's listen to the information that you got. Uh, for example, Alex or Susie. Mm, okay. Mi pregunta, hey. fue, mi pregunta fue, when is the, your birthday? Where, ah, birthday, yes. So tell mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. His birthday is on December 2. Ah, his, December 2nd. 2nd, second second December 2nd. Okay, good. Second, okay. Okay, mm -hmm. good. Now let's listen to Alex. Okay, Alex, tell me something about Susie. Mm, pregunta fue, what is your favorite singer? Mm -hmm. Is my favorite ah, band. Okay, her favorite, her favorite. Her favorite band. Mm -hmm. This is band, solo band. Ah, okay. Band. Este, mi pregunta fue, What is your favorite singer? singer? Ajá, ¿cuál es tu cantante favorito? Ajá. Is there a <laughs> singer? Creo que lo, lo confundimos quizás porque me dijo Vance. Yes, yes. Ajá. Okay, yes. So, Susie, 
Es wow. que no tengo cantante favorito, por eso le dije a mi banda, oh, no vaya. tengo cantante, mi banda My es Bicky Park. Mi favorite band, ah, <risa> My favorite, ok, ok, good. Nice. Teacher, y Dime. con la, con la, por ejemplo, la seis, el who, podría preguntar como who is your sister, mm -hmm. como quién es tu hermana. Ya, yeah, sí. could it be, yes. Está bien, sí. Oh, who is your favorite actor, who is your favorite mm. soccer player, who is your... Who, who is your best friend? Entonces, normalmente, ¿para quién? Who is your boss? ¿Quién es tu jefe? Who is your husband? Uh -huh. Entonces, se pueden hacer varias preguntas con respecto o a O sea, who. que con esa no podría ocupar como do, ¿verdad? O sí, ¿cómo podría poner no. un ejemplo con do? No, no. ¿cómo no? Uh, por ejemplo, vamos a ver, who do you... Who do you work with? Pero el with se utiliza al final, entonces se traduciría con quién trabajas. Uh -huh. sí, se puede. Y yeah. el do, profe, es obligato obligatorio siempre ponerlo, o no mm, se puede poner. Con el resto de preguntas, sí, con el who, no. Con el who normalmente es eh, who is, ¿verdad? Yo sugiero que comience con ese, who is. Después van a ir aprendiendo cómo se dice nosotros, ¿ok? Then no problem. Okay, let's, let's listen to Diana. Okay, Diana, tell me something about Judith, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Question is, what's your last name? Answer, Judith's last name is Bautista. It's okay. Nice. Okay, Marlon, tell me something about Andrea. Yes. Mm, yes. Okay. Uh, 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 the question, what do you do on Saturdays? Uh, she works all day. Thank you. No le creo mucho, but that's nice. <laughs> okay. Hey, Andrea, tell me something about Marlon. Uh, when, your, when your birthday, Marlon's birthday is in March. It's March. Ah, ya pasó. I'm sorry. Marlon, I'm sorry. No podemos dar ningún regalo. Ok, we're going to continue later. Vamos a continuar después con eso. Sé que la mayoría tiene pues ya, ya sus, uh, sus preguntas y todo eso. Nice. I like that you now can ask different types of questions. Ahora pueden hacer diferentes tipos de preguntas. Maybe you can't. You could before. Tal vez pueden antes. But now you have like a variety of words, a variety of questions that you can ask to, uh, to somebody. Ya después podemos hacer más cosas. Okay? So. What is the best advice you have received? Received on the, al final, received, because it's past, porque el pasado. Esto se llama pasado participio, o sea, have received. Que lo aplicamos en el español. Es igual. ¿Cuál es el mejor consejo que tú has recibido? Has, es el have, hace la función de has recibido. Okay. So we're going to start with Susie porque because she's so sleepy, tiene mucho sueño, tiene un par de preguntas para ella. I have a little question for her, but later. Ya se me fue el sueño, ya podemos decir esa parte. No, no, bro, no. Tienes que mentir. Y después le voy a hacer unas preguntas a una rubia que salió por ahí. Okay. Okay. The best advice. I have received. I have received. I have received is like your life no live your life as if it were the last day wow vive tu vida como que si fuera la última life uh, live your life mm -hmm. okay as eh, eh, as eh, if it were the oh, last sería life quizás no 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 así está bien live es vivir y life es el sustantivo Ajá. Vive la vida al máximo, to the top. Mm -hmm. As if it, if it were the last day of your life. Como que si fuera el último día de tu vida. Bueno, si fuera mi último día, hiciera muchas cosas. Ok. Uh, but that, that's a, a, a nice advice because it shows you to appreciate the time. Te enseña a apreciar más el tiempo. Ok. So, ok, la rubia del avión. Uh -huh. And then, uh, Claudia. Ok, Nancy, vamos. I have received is to take care of me health. 
my health. health. Yes. Cuidar tu salud. And it, it is about not only physical, okay, but also mental and uh, emotional health. ¿Verdad? Salud mental, ¿verdad? Salud emocional, yes. Pretty important, okay? So, thank you. Uh, Claudia, we go with Claudia and then Christian, okay? I have received is... Podemos decir así, ve. The advice I have received... Mm -hmm. M -M -S -M -S -S. The advice. The advice I have received is mm -hmm. the advice I have received is mm -hmm. okay. The advice I have received is what do you do with your left hand that does not know right? Okay, what you do with your right hand mm -hmm. doesn't know mm, the, the left hand, ¿verdad? Eh, mm, que lo que hace tu mano derecha que no lo haga, que, que no lo sepa, ¿verdad? No lo sepa. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay, so keep in silence if you do a good... Uh, secret if you... Do some, and it can be, uh, especially if you do a good action, just una buena acción específicamente. Because now in in the social media, in on Facebook, for example, it is very common that you do something good, but you take pictures and you post it. And you say, I did this, yo hice esto, okay? So for the people comment or, or click on like, okay? Y no se trata solamente de eso, right? Okay, thank you, Claudia. Ya me puse filósofo. Okay, uh, now we go with Christian, right? And then go with uh, Dora. Uh, the advice I have received is uh, read well what is going to be signed. Mm -hmm. Read well, lee bien. Sí, leer bien antes mm -hmm. de lo, lo que se va a firmar. Antes yeah. de firmar. Yes, sign es firmar. Signature es firma. Signature, signature, sure, sure, como te decía, sure, ok. Y sign también significa signo o símbolo. Vale, Pero, Hello? Ok, se, se disparó, Claudia. Ok, sign, <laughs> sign es firmar y signature es firma, ok. So that's one of the, the most important advice. Yes, Christian, because sometimes you, because you are in a hurry, ustedes están apresurados, you sign and you don't read all the, the details of the contract, maybe algunos contratos así donde, pues, verdad, no va mal. Thank you. Okay, and now we go with Dora, right, Dora? The best advice I have received is see, hear, and shut up. Mm, okay. See? Hear? Mm, see, hear, se refiere a verla a ella. No. E oír. Ver y oír. Y callar. Okay. See, hear, and pongámosle keep silence porque shut up se escucha muy cállate que me desespera ok se va ok <laughs> see here and keep silence ok it is good not to show all the the efforts a veces los esfuerzos que nosotros tenemos because people transmit negative energy with negative ideas yeah hay gente que desea el mal yeah that happens ok Marlon ok my friend tell me what is the best advice you have received and then yeah. we go with after we go with Alex. Uh, the best advice uh, I have received is uh, if someone gives you an advice, you have to think. You never have to contradict it. Uh, yeah, uh, contradict. Mm -hmm. 
Ajá. Si alguien te da un consejo, tienes que agradecerlo. You have to thanks and you have to to listen or, or yes, listen. listen. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you attention. never mm -hmm. You never have to contradict. Yes, uh, because contradict. especially if our parents, nuestros padres, or a fa or a family or a relative. Uh, tells you uh, an advice is because he or she wants something good for you or a, a good friend. Yes. yes. Uh, but most people don't listen. They ignore, ignore them. They ignore the, the advice. Okay. So that's it. Yes. And that, that happens with our, our kids. So pasa con nuestros niños también. And we mm -hmm. remember when we were young. Recordamos cuando éramos todavía jovencitos. But that's it. Well, yes. thank you. De hecho, de hecho, ese consejo nos lo dio un profesor en la universidad. Really? A long time sí, ago, hace, hace bastante tiempo. Uh, sí, yes. It's like, a, like the three years ago. Okay, yes. Well, but that, that, that is a good one. Always listen. Okay, thank you. Okay, and... Um, okay, um... What about Alex? The advice I had received is be, be yourself no matter what other thing of you. Wow, that, that, that's good. Be yourself no matter mm -hmm. what others what think, of thing, you. think of you. Yes. Sé tú mismo, no importa lo, lo que piensen de ti, ¿verdad? Ok, si te comes todo el bote de curtido con dos pupusas, no matter. You don't care, que no les importa. No, no. That, that's nice because it's, uh, it is about identity. Se trata de identidad, right? What you think, what you feel, que piensan, que sienten, yes. Thank you. Uh, we continue later with the rest. So now I know that you know that this is a, a really clear and we already know it. Ya lo sabemos. Así que la rubia viene y me va a pronunciar esta palabra que está acá. Okay. How do you say this? Recruit. 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 Okay. Thank you. Okay. Vamos con Susi. La durmiente. Vamos con the first one. Okay. Research. Research, okay. I think it is too. Okay, now we go with um, Leslie. Leslie, I need you to tell me this one. One. No, no, just this word. Solo esta palabra. Develop. Thank you. So here we have production, research, development, purchasing, marketing, human resources, management, accounting, and finance. And now here we have on scramble letters. Okay, uh, Christian, do you remember what is on scramble? Te recuerdas que es on scramble? Ordenar. Yes. Como dejar ese relajo. So we have one, two, three. De lo que acabamos de ver. Okay, and so I will need Marlon, Andrea, and Diana. Okay, Marlon, select one. A number two, purchasing. Okay. okay, purchasing, that's good. Okay, vamos con Susie, yes, I'm aquí, dejamos de último. Okay, Susie. Number three. Mm -hmm. Human resource, eh, perdón, human resource, así es, ¿verdad? Sigue tu corazón, eh, dale. Management. Ok, ok. Human resources management. Management. Eh, tu corazoncito está algo <ríe> inquieto. Andrea, number one. You can do it, Andrea. Number one. I can. Yes, you can. Así decía Obama cuando iba para presidente. You can. Ah, no, we can. Yo soy de mentiroso. Yes, we can. Sí, nosotros podemos. Vale, decime sí. algo, pues. Decime algo. Algo. No. <risa> Come on, related. 
Me troleo, me lo tomo. Ok, related to this. ¿Qué crees? What do you think? Ay, no te... Ay, ¿Ya te lo mostré? Ay, no. ¿Otra vez? Ok. Ok. ¿Cho? ¿Cho? No la vi. One, two, three. So, number production. one. Production. Production. Yes, production. Ok, ya me van a decir. You're going to say the definition. Ya me van a decir la definición también. So, what do they do? ¿Qué hacen? Ok, ya me van a decir eso. So, now we go with uh, the, the others. And for this, I will need... I will need... Christian. I will need Diana. And... Claudia. Okay, yeah, Christian. What number? Uh, number four. Number four. Kindergarten. Uh -huh. What is it? Okay. Mm -hmm. It's a fácil, Christian. Okay, I will I will give you time. Te daré tiempo. Diana. Okay. Number two, uh -huh. research and development. Good. And Claudia, number six. Más fácil. Accounting and finance. Finance. And finance. Finance. Okay, Christian, what is number four? Christian, okay. No. I don't Tres know. segundos. One. Two, three, yeah. Number two is mm. number four. <laughs> number four is. Vamos. Re okay. Research. No, no, no. It's, no. It's, it's, it's inventando. Mm. Yeah, no. Mira, okay. So I'm going to give you three seconds. Come on. Y no me va a reñar Andrea, que te estoy dando más tiempo. Okay, no. Ajá. Ok, Nancy is going to help you. Nancy te va a ayudar. Ok, Cristian. Creo que tu corazón mm -hmm. está confundido. Marketing. Ah, marketing. Buena ley. Ok, so, here we have also. Miren qué bonito estos macarrones. So, here we have this, and I need you to take notes about. Two birds. Okay. So please remember, please remember like two or three words. Las primeras dos o tres palabras. About what you're going to, to say about the well, the, the option you selected. Acerca de las palabras que seleccionaron. No quiero que me lo digan todo. Just the first three or four words. Las primeras tres o cuatro palabras. Okay. So now that you are ready, the yeah, ten lista. Okay, so let's. Um, okay, number one. Donde está Andreita? Number one. What is control and supervise? Wow, good. Number two, purchasing. Quién fue que me inventó purchasing? Who was? Who was? Who was? Quién fue? Quién fue? Ah, Marlon. Hey, my friend. What do they? Eh. Do? A boy buy and acquire new new raw materials. Mm -hmm. That's nice. That's nice. Yes, that's the the, the definition. And Korea del Sur. Who said number three? Who said? Who said? Susi. Me estaba escondiendo. Okay. Uh -huh. hmm. Recruit, uh, select, and train uh, new employees. Okay, that's nice. Se dan cuenta que it is not necessary to have the complete definition with the with the few words you can know what is the meaning, well, or the definition. Okay, uh, let's go with number two. Sachir Danve Plemento. What is number two? Number two. Okay. 
Uh, research and development. Research and development. Ok, te me estaba respondiendo. Number four. <laughs> Blondie. Uh, Ajá, Nancy. Eh, identify what customer. Customer. Ok. Identify. Identify what identify customer, customer need. Ajá, algo así. Ok, mm -hmm. thank you. And accounting and finance said Claudia, right? ¿Verdad, Claudia? Yes. Ok. And keep the financial record. Ok, keep the financial records. Financial. Ok, financial. records. Porque si decimos records, es diferente. Estamos hablando de records. Ok, thank you. Aquí tenemos esto. Ya se lo saben bastante bien. We have now with a speaking activity. Vamos a hacer algo. We're going to, aquí dice, interview a partner about his or her activities on a typical day at work using information questions and prepositions of time. ¿Qué quiere decir? That you're going to ask uh, to your classmate, for example, what do you do in the morning? En el trabajo, we're talking about, uh, well, not only at work, maybe from in, at, the, at home, okay, or during the transportation. What do you do in the afternoon? What do you do in the evening? So I need you just to take note of two activities in the morning, two activities in the afternoon, and two activities in the evening, okay? So at, at, in total, it will be six activities, six activities, okay? So maybe you can be like, for example, Susie and Mar, no, Susie and, I don't remember who was your classmate, Susan, your partner. Alexander. Okay, so Susan Alexander. Okay, so you write here two activities that he does. Okay, uh, I need you to uh, write the time. Necesito que escriban la hora. It's important to write the time. Okay. So uh, remember, in the morning, in the afternoon, and in the evening. So let's say. Okay, see you.
No. Um, not o'clock. Um, mm -hmm. So, si, ¿qué, ¿qué hace sola en esta vida? Contame. No sé, nadie me quiere. Ay, ay, así dicen. ¿Con quién estabas? Con Alexander Bogran. Ok. Pero creo que tenía problemas con el internet, ¿no? Así me dijo la primera sí, vez. Sí, sí, sí. Que no se conectó, no se conectó. Se salió y todo eso. Ok, let's do it. Vamos a hacerlo. Ok. Ok, bye. Ya, le doy la respuesta de una vez. Ok, what do you do in the morning? Ok, in the morning I take my, I get up at 5 a.m. Mm -hmm. I go to my work at uh, 6 a.m. Mm -hmm. In the afternoon, I grab, I write, write report at um, 3, 3 p.m. I arrive. 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 Que finish. No, sería I finish my work at 5 p.m. Mm -hmm. In the evening, I arrive at home at 7 p.m. And I... Ay, ¿Cómo es? ¿Recibir? Receive. Recibir. I receive. receive. I receive a English class. Así. English class. English class. English. English class. Okay. At 8 p.m. At 8 p.m. Okay. That's good. Well, in the morning, let me see. I wake up at 5.30 a.m. And I take a shower at... at diga la five, verdad, diga la verdad, ya estoy Yes, I, I'm saying the truth. <laughs> and I take a shower at 5 and 40 minutes. So I need to, like 10 minutes to, to wake up okay. real well. In the afternoon, okay. I come home at 5 p.m. and I watch some news, veo noticias. And let's see, and at night I have dinner at 7 p.m. and I have my dear and beautiful class at 8 p.m. <laughs> okay. 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 Sí, sí, ya, ya estuvo. No, es que mire, me ha tocado algo pesado este día y sentía ya el cansancio. Me imagino, no, yo sé, yo sé que es cansado, es que pierden, pero, pero bueno, ya, sí. ya casi, solo. Ya, sí, a poquito. poquito. Sí, a sí. poquito. You relax. <ríe> y usted trabaja durante el día en otra cosa. Yes, I, I teach English to, from kindergarten to high school. Desde kinder oh. hasta bachillerato, pero estamos en modalidad Y es chivo. Y con niños de kinder, ¿cómo hace? <ríe> En virtual me toca mandarles videos y, y estoy pues, um, ¿qué? Así con videos, videollamadas y cositas así, pero son cortas. Pero mm. en persona yo tenía que andar saltando, jugando con ellos y todo eso. Sí, me imagino. Una gran experiencia. No, es chivo, pero es cansadísimo. Ahora que no lo estoy viendo, sí, ya, ya está más tranquilo, más relax. Mm. Ya con okay. el es bien, bien relax, así. Ajá. Sí, hasta más relajo que nosotros han de hacer, me imagino. No, fíjate que no permito tanto relajo, pero soy bien serio. Es que, ah. es que se pasan los bichos, se pasan. ¿no? Sí, eso sí. Sí, entonces eso. Con algunas veces sí una broma, pero, pero yo quisiera relajar más, pero no puedo. No puedo. Sí, es mejor. Es mejor mantener la distancia. Soy una persona, sí. Okay. <risa> ok. Ya te veo en clase. Ok. Chévere. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay, Jose, I know that you are driving. Sé que va manejando, Jose. Toca pesado. I can see that it is difficult, Jose Miguel, but well, ánimo. Hurry up. Okay, uh, Diana, okay. Can you tell me something about your classmates? Okay. 
In the morning eh, sería como decirle las actividades he, de la mañana. Solo, solo decime dos. He or she. Uh -huh. O decime el nombre uh, mejor. Judith, check the mail. Check eight eh, o'clock. At eight o'clock. Uh -huh. And... Ah, es cierto. At eh, eight o'clock. Uh -huh. And... And check Judith, check the inbox. At nine o'clock. Okay. okay, and checks. Judy checks. Checks. Okay. okay, that's nice. Okay, let's listen to Dora. Okay, Dora, tell me. Um, Kelvin, creo. Okay, Kelvin, what? <laughs> uh -huh. What more? does he do? ¿Qué hace Kelvin? In the morning, uh, go to work at six o'clock. Okay, Kelvin goes to work. Mm -hmm. Goes to work at six mm -hmm. o'clock. And? And he ha have breakfast. And he has breakfast. Okay, that's, that's good. Okay, let's listen to Kelvin. Vamos a escuchar a Kelvin ahora. Hello, Kelvin. Tell me something about Dora. Okay, okay. In, in the morning, in, in, in the five. At five. Uh -huh, at five o'clock in AM. Mm -hmm. uh, at work. Okay, she, she goes. Uh -huh, she goes to work. Okay. To work. Then. And in breakfast in the seven o'clock. Okay, she okay, she has breakfast at seven o'clock. Okay, thank you, thank you. Now we continue. Quiero seguir avanzando en este tema. And we go now. What is the best advice you have received? Algunos que todavía no me han dicho. So in your case, let's listen to what about if we listen to Leslie? Leslie. Ah, no, ya me lo dijiste. Leslie ya me lo dijo. Um, no. No. Ah, pues no, Leslie. Go ahead. No. El, el mejor consejo. Yes. The best advice. No. No. Bueno. Go ahead. Adelante. The best, the best advice I have received was that they told my dad I should be well be who I wanted to be, not what people expect me to be. Okay, okay. Hey, teacher, what I want to be, okay? Not what people want me to be, ¿verdad? Estar seguro de lo que yo quiero ser, no de lo que la gente quiere. And that's for real, eso es muy real, okay? Thank you, thank you very much. Now let's listen to uh, Christian. Ya había pasado. Ah, pues, y Alex Bográn. Creo que, ah, pues, Alex. Sí, igual sí, well, ya, ya. Um, Claudia. Ya. Yeah. Bueno, le puse chequecita. Para estar eh, como estaba bien entretenido con esto. Escuchándolos. Ok, Kelvin, tell me. Hello. I am ready. Ok, go ahead, my friend. Mm, the, best, the best advice I have received is to go without looking at the who. Ok. Uh, to do or to what? Mm -hmm. mm, yes. Ajá, sería uh, hacer y no mirar a quién, ¿verdad? Yes, yes. To do mm -hmm. without to whom? ¿Qué es to whom? ¿Qué es lo mismo? Solo que se to whom se utiliza de todo esto. Okay, thank you, Kelvin. Perfect. Okay, uh -huh. um, uh, let's uh, listen to Andrea. Yeah. Yes. Ah, pues, no, Susi, me falta. También. Estuvo, fui la primera. 
Es que como hoy, hoy sí no les puse. Es cierto, eso sí. Eh, Carla. También Carla, ¿verdad? Yo dije, me falta entonces. También. Me parece que todo haya pasado. No, yo aún no. ¿Quién? ¿Quién no? Yo, yo vi. Ah, sí, ya ves que tú, yo dije, no, yo sabía que tú no. Ok, contame, yo dije, ¿cuál es el best advice you have received? Eh, ¿Cómo era que se decía de, de inicio? Aquí está, Ali, la, la primera. The best advice I have received. Ajá. Eh, the best advice I have received is do not be discouraged by anything. Okay. Don't be encouraged or This, Ajá. De, no te desanimes. Okay. Ok. Ok. Thank you. Um, who else? Who else? Diana. <risa> Ay, pensé que no iba a decir. Ah, pues Ay. no ande pensando. <risa> ok. Um, the best advice I have is receive. Is the best form to say a secret is don't tell to anybody. Wow. So the best secret, uh, well, if you want to keep the uh, best secret, si quieres, si quieres mantenerlo como secreto, don't tell anybody. Secrets. Wow. O sea, que con nadie, con nadie. Se puede aguantar, no decir secret. Okay. Okay. And now we're going to let's see. Okay, thank you. No, antes que nada, um, before anything, alguien se me queda. No, I think everybody. Claudia, como goza. Ah, Claudia. No, I think everybody. Sí, porque bueno, algunos todavía van de camino. Okay. So. Eh, countries and nationalities. Te voy a, vaya, veamos esto durante 10 seconds, 10 segundos. Y después me dicen un par de palabras. Okay. Okay. We start with Kelvin. Okay, Kelvin. Tell me one word that you remember. Uh, Italy. Italy. Okay, thank you. Carla. Italian. And, uh, Italian. And Italian. Okay, thank you. Carla, then Nancy. Brazil. Um, United States. United States. United States. Okay, Brazil. Nancy and Alex. Nancy. Uh, England. Inglaterra. England. Okay, England. English, English, English. Hmm? Okay, English, English, English. Okay, Alex, and then we we'll go with Judith. German. In Italy. German and Italy, okay, that's good. Um, Leslie. Canada, Canadian, English, and French. Okay, thank you. Y me falta Judith, me parece. Right, Judith? England, English. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, that's good. Now the rest, ahora el resto a quien no le he preguntado, Look at this. Look to the other uh, photograph. Okay. I think it's enough and enough. Okay, we start with Dora and Claudia. Colombia. 
Colombia, pura cumbia. Ah, ya sé por qué la elegiste. Ok, thank you. Claudia. Denmark. Ok, good. Ok, and now we go with by Nancy, que dice la rubia en el radio. Ok, go ahead, rubia. Dale, Nancy, con todo. Que no te detenga nadie, dale. Go ahead. Nancy le tiene miedo al éxito. Ok. Ok, good. De último te voy a dejar. Ok, Andrea. Egypt. Egypt, la egipcia me saliste. Marlon, then Diana. Colombian. Colombia. Ah, a ver, te gusta la cumbia también. Ok. Diana en Susi. El Salvador. El, va, te la ganaron, mira, Benan, si la regaste. Ok. Eh, Susi. Estonia, Estonia. Ok, good. Ah, Christian, me hace falta Christian. Eh, sería Vietnam. Ok. Thank you. Ok, aquí we have uh, this, and it is important to know countries and nationalities because sometimes in our job we meet people from other countries. Conocemos gente de diferentes países, and it is good maybe to talk about their cultures, hablar sobre sus culturas, or at least to know how to say the nationality or the language that that person speaks. Ok. So here we have Canada, 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 Canadian, English and French. So you can see here, countries, nationality, and language. Okay, so this is the country, this is the nationality, and this is the language, okay? So, um, Canada, no Canada, Canada teacher, no, Canada, Canadian, English, French because they speak both languages. United States, not a United, United, United States, American, English. Italy, con, con R, Italy. You can say Italy, but people, most people say Italy. Italian, Italian is the same. Brazil, Z, like zebra, con la Z, Brazilian, I'm sorry, Brazil, Brazilian, Portuguese, Portuguese. Germany, German, German. I can see the person that's called German, okay. And here we have England, English, English, okay. Eh, los ingleses y el idioma inglés. England, England, okay. Vietnam. Vietnamese, Vietnamese. Denmark, Danish, Danish. Colombia, Colombian, Spanish. Y nosotros decimos Colombian, Colombia. No, it's Colombia. Es como cuando dicen Guatemala, Costa Rica. Y nosotros decimos Costa Rica, Costa Rica. Um, uh, Ecuador, Ecuadorian, Spanish. Equator, Ecuadorian, Spanish. Egypt, Egypt, Egyptian, Arabic. El Salvador, no El Salvador, El Salvador, Salvadorian, Spanish. Estonia, Estonian, Estonian. Australia, Australian, English, como la leche, la leche australian. Okay, so that's it. And now that you have like a better idea, here we have, and we're going to use some of these uh, nationalities in some of, of these uh, languages, because sometimes it is different. For example, in Colombia, it's a country, Colombia, the nationality. So uh, a person who comes from Colombia, they can say, I am from Colombia, or I come from Colombia. Uh, I am Colombian, soy colombiano. I'm Salvadorian, so, soy salvadoreño. I come from El Salvador, I'm Salvadorian, and my language is Spanish, y mi idioma es el español. So that the same happens here, for example, uh, Brazil, I come from Brazil, Ronaldinho, for example, he is from Brazil, he is Brazilian, 
and he speaks Portuguese. He habla portugués. Okay. So um, now we're going to study a conversation. So nos queda, we have like uh, 25 minutes, 25 minutes, and we finished. Okay. So here we have this conversation. Um, conversation one. What languages, languages, listen bien, no languages, languages, languages. Do you speak? I speak English and I study Spanish. ¿Verdad que tenemos Spain? Bueno, it's a school. De ahí la, la más está fácil. Japanese, ¿verdad? Japanese, Japan. Japanese, Japan. Japanese, Japan. French. French. Creo que hay un perrito que se llama French Poodle, creo. Ok. Thai. Thai. Chinese. Korean. K-pop. No recuerdo quién le gusta el K-pop. ¿Quién dijo que le gusta? So, Chinese. Korean. K-pop. German. England. German. England. Chelsea. Para lo que le gusta Premier League. Chelsea. Premier League. Okay, uh, so this is very simple. We're going to start with Christian and Diana. Okay, uh, Christian, you're the man, uh, Diana, you're the woman. And then we have Leslie, number two, and Alex is man. Okay, man, Alex, number two, woman, Leslie, number two. Okay, but first we go with number one. Okay, uh, Christian. What languages? What what languages uh, do you speak? I speak English and I study Spanish. Mm -hmm. That that's cool. Uh, do you have friends from Spain? No, but I like Mexican TV shows. Me too. Uh, I love uh, movies in Spanish. Movies in yeah. Spanish. Yeah. Spanish is so cool. Spanish is tan genial. Dice, ah, no saben las palabritas que nos manejamos. Right? Okay. <laughs> Number two. Uh, yes. Leslie and... Who's... Uh, ¿Quién dije? And Alex, right? Yes. Okay. Number three. I will need Carla. Like woman. And for man, I will need Nancy. Okay, number three, man, Nancy, woman, uh, Carla. So we go with number two. Do you like Japanese food? Okay. Um, yes, I love, ¿cómo se dice eso? Japanese, Japanese, Jap Japanese. Japan. Yes, yes, I like Japanese food. I live I in live. Japan I live. before. Mm -hmm. I live in, in Japan before. Japan before. Oh. Oh, do you speak Japanese? Some. Some. I had Japanese friends. I practiced with them. Do you they speak English? Mm, do they? Do they speak English? Do they speak English? Yes. Yes. yes, they speak English very well. Yes, they speak, speak English very well. Okay, now we go yes, with number Yes, they speak. Yes, okay, good, thank you. Excellent. We go now with number four and uh, number three. And for number four, y para el número cuatro, we're going to uh, listen to Andrea and Susie for number four. Andrea, you are man and Susie, you are woman. Okay. So number three, action. What food do you like? I like French food and Thai food. Me too. Me, me too. I also love Chinese food. Do you like Korea? Korea fo Korean food? Yes, I. Yes, and, and I, I also, also love K-pop. What is K-pop? 
Feedback is Korean, but music. Okay, nice. Okay, number four, showtime. Do you like football? Yes, I love football. I watch German football, Italian football, Spanish football. Me too. I want I want to go to England England to watch my team. What is your team? Chelsea. They play in the English Premier League. Oh, my favorite team is AC Milan. They play in Italy. Italy. They, Italy. they play. They play in Italy. Okay, good. Uh, please, I need to have screenshots from conversation one and two. Eso va a ser ya casi la última actividad. Ok, conversation one y conversation two. Ok. Y ahora we go with conversation three and four. I'm sorry. Yes. Okay. So we're going to practice and then we're going to have the last activity, short, very short activity. Después tenemos la última actividad, okay? So please, um, let's practice a little bit. Vamos a practicar un poquito. Sure. Susi, ¿qué pasa? Hola. Estás de rebelde. Es que, es que no sé por qué no me carga. Solo me dice prepare meet, meeting. Va, y no me ahorita. carga más. Veamos ahorita. Ok, ok. okay. <risa> qué bárbara. Pero teacher, no me aparece, no me puedo meter. Me puede volver a como a, a sugerir el... Yo, yo pensando que ya estaba ahí. ¿Ahora? No, ok.
Nada. Hoy sí, eso sí, no, como que nada. <ríe> Pero no me aparece, ¿por qué no me sale nada? A mí no me sale nada. Y no, ya estamos en el grupo, pues. Yo estoy en el grupo. Uy, qué raro esto. Ajá. Vamos. Okay. Vamos a seguir. Okay, ya puede brillar. Ah, sí. Vamos. Number okay, one. Ahorita, ahorita. Aquí ahorita, lo tengo, aquí lo estoy compartiendo. Pero es que no puedo ver el, el, uh -huh. el detalle ese. Vaya, ok, ya, ya estuvo. Ustedes ven. Sí. ¿Ven? Sí. Ok. What language do you speak? <laughs> I speak English and and I study Spanish. That's cool. Do you have friends from Spain? No, but I like Mexican TV shows. Me too. I love movies in Spanish. Yeah, Spanish is so cool. Do you like Japanese food? Yes, I love Japanese food. I lived in Japan before. Oh, do you speak Japanese? Some, I have Japanese friends. I practice with them. Practice. Mm -hmm. practice, practice, okay. Do they speak English? Yes, they speak English very well. What food do you like? I like French food and Thai food. Me too. I also love Chinese food. Do you like Korean food? Yes, and I also love K-pop. What is K-pop? K-pop is Korean pop music. The last one. Uh, do you like football? Yes, I love football. I watch German football, Italy, Italian, Italy, no, Italian. Italian. Italian football, Spanish football. Me too. I want to go to England to watch my team. What's your, what is your team? Chelsea. They play in the English Premier League. Oh, my favorite team is AC Milan. They play in Italy. 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 <laughs> Italy. Italy. Muy bien, Susi. Vamos, ya casi terminamos. Ok, voy yo, okay. ¿verdad? ¿No? Voy yo, no. No, no, ya terminamos. Ah, ok. okay. Good, yo good. Ahora. Ok, we have uh, una review, una revisión, porque vamos a hacer una actividad, eh, la última actividad, uh, con ways to say yo también, formas de decir yo también, and also here we have ways to say yo tampoco, para la forma de decir yo también o yo tampoco, que ahorita vamos a utilizar este, ¿cómo se llama? Estas frases, we're going to use these phrases, to answer one activity, para eh, pues, contestar una actividad, ¿ok? Pero antes de eso vamos a hacer una... ¿Qué? Solo voy a mostrar una imagen. I'm going to show you a picture. Les eh, muestro una imagen y ustedes me dicen qué. ¿Ok? So, easy cheesy. Tres segundos. Ok, Andrea. Ya que está rezando, ya te vi. Bueno, los lagos. Ok, Andrea, tell me one. Snowy. Snowy. Ok, Dora. Sunday. ¿Mm? Sunny. Sony. Sony. Ok, Marlon. Eh, rainy. <ríe> Estás inventando, pero me llega. Yeah, that's good. Rainy, good. Vamos a ver, Susi. Ya dijeron tres, la yo anoté Rainbow. Ah, Rainbow, yeah, Rainbow, yes. Um, Kelvin, do you remember another? Windy. Windy, yes. Diana? Stormy. Stormy, bien. Creo que o tienen buena memoria o me hacen trampa. Ok, here we have Sony. Como el televisor es Sony, pero escribe diferente Sony. Rainy, snowy, rainbow, windy, foggy, cloudy, stormy. I live in Planet de Rendero. So here it is foggy. It's very foggy, especially in La Puerta del Diablo. Have you visited La Puerta del Diablo? Well, it is a nice place and it is foggy. Es, es, se pone es como 
baja la neblina, ahí es bien, bien, bien bonito, bien romántico, ahí para, para comer el otro. Yeah. Eh, y, y a todo. So, sunny, rainy, snowy, rainbow, windy, foggy, cloudy, stormy. Sunny es soleado, rainy, lluvioso, snowy, eh, pues cuando está nevando, aquí nunca ha nevado. Bueno, well, en el pital, en el pital, I think once, but it was a uh, few, fue poco. Rainbow, que esta es, no es la bandera del Pride, ¿verdad? Sino que esta es, eh, como se llama, arco iris. Windy, cuando hace viento. Y cuando se, cuando... <laughs> Sometimes it is rainy and windy. And I don't know if you have uh, used an umbrella and the wind, like, pushes, como que la empuja y todo eso. A veces pasa. Foggy, ya le dije que es como nublado, cloudy. Es, eh, foggy es como se llama... Es la neblina que baja por la, casi por la calle, al nivel de la calle. Cloudy es cuando está nublado, pero sobre el cielo. Stormy es, pues, tormenta. Ok, so let's listen. What's your favorite weather? ¿Cuál es su clima favorito? Ok, Marlon, what is your favorite weather? Then, Andrea. Uh, my favorite weather is uh, um, rainy. Rainy, ok. But drinking chocolate or coffee. Ok, o tequila. Ok, Andrea de Nancy. Foggy. Foggy. Mm. Ok. Sí, hace como frío. Yes. Well, you need sweater. Necesita un sweater o a jacket. Ok. O a person. Yes, ok. So, Nancy, then Claudia. Claudi. Claudi. Acuérdense de Claudia. Claudi. Una de mis ex. Claudia, pero sin la A, ¿verdad? Claudi. Ah, ok. Eh, ah, sí, aquí tenemos a Claudia. Ok, Claudia. Tell me. Sony. No, pero no fuiste vos, Claudia, obviamente. No, no. Another person, another person. Ok. <laughs> Diana, your turn. ¿Cuál es el favorito? Rainy. Rainy. Ok. Let's go. Carla. And then Susie. Um. Windy. Windy. Uh -huh. Windy. Uh -huh. Windy. Se seca más rápido. Ok. Uh, Susie, then Kelvin. So, um, I, I, Windy. Uh, so do I. So do I. Windy. So do I. Ok. Uh -huh. okay. Uh, really. My favorite weather is Windy también, teacher. Windy, too. Ok. Yo siempre me enfermo cuando está Windy. Siempre me da gripe. Ok. Uh, that's why I don't like. But, ok. Dora. Tell me, Dora. Sony. 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 Cuando dicen Sony, me recuerdo unos refrescos que vendían así. Pero ese es Sony. ¿verdad? Sony, Sony. Okay. Yes. Yes, Sony. If you have washed your clothes, y has lavado tu ropa, Sony, whether it's perfect. Okay. And uh, what about Alex and then Christian? Yeah, my favorite weather is windy. Windy, okay. Uh, Christian. Uh, my favorite word is, is foggy and rainy. Oh, wow, foggy and rainy. Leslie and Judith. My favorite weather is stormy. Mm -hmm. Stormy, okay. Yes. Okay, good. Judith. My favorite weather is sunny. Sunny, ok. Solo yo dije a Leslie le gusta sunny. Bueno, si no hay goteras, no problem. Ok. Be careful with the drops. Cuidado con las gotas. Ok. Um, seis minutos y terminamos. Vamos a hacer esta actividad. Necesito, I need you to have it clear, que tengan claro cómo se dice yo también. And how do you say yo tampoco. Ok. Because we're going to use it in the next uh, activity. So remember, yo también, me too, I'm happy too, I love you too, or so am I, so do I. Estas son las principales. So am I or so do I. Puedes decir esta, this one or this, or even me too, okay? And for to say, yo tampoco que, si se dan cuenta, son oraciones negativas, negativas, y estas son afirmativas. 
I am not either or I don't either. O pueden decir, neither am I or neither do I. Les sugiero que digan esta, this, I suggest you to say this or this. Okay, neither am I or neither do I. Okay, these are like the most important. Obviously, you can say this, I am not either, I don't either, claro. That's why I am showing uh, these options. Por eso les muestro las opciones, because you can say the one that you prefer, but I personally suggest you to say neither am I or neither do I. Personalmente, pues les sugiero eso. Okay, so here we have some sentences, okay? Here are only eight sentences. So, for example, Sara loves chocolate. Digamos que todos ustedes son Jenny. Entonces, Sara loves chocolate. Ustedes van a contestar a mí. Si es afirmativa, a mí también. And if it is negative, you can say yo tampoco. Si una negativa, ¿verdad? Tiene que ser yo tampoco. So, we start with Diana and then Marlon. Okay, Diana, pick one number. Two. Two, 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 two. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. No, nada. Okay. I, mean, I don't play the piano. Neither do I. Yes, neither do I. Thank you. Okay, who's next? Marlon, and then we we'll go with Dora. Uh, number one, Sara loves chocolate. Uh, uh, so do I. Yeah, so do I, if you like chocolate, okay? Good, and now we go with Dora and Judith. Eight. Eight, Conte, porque si no, A me dice como eight, teacher. Eight. Eight. She. She doesn't have any brothers or sister. Neither I am. Neither. Neither. Um, I. No, porque está utilizando el doesn't have. Que sería neither do. Okay, neither, neither do I. Neither do I. Neither okay. Do I. Okay, good. Who's next? ¿Quién va al siguiente? Jodis, ¿verdad? That's number four. No, uh, Jodis and then Alex. Okay, number four. She isn't in the party. Mm -hmm. uh, so do I. It's negative. Para negativo no utilizamos son, solo ah, para negativo. Sí, sería um, neither I am. Ok, yes. Jenny is in the party, neither I am. Ok. Alex and then Andrea. Um, six. Ok, six. Uh, I had to study. Study. Yeah. This weekend. Mm -hmm. So do I. Yes, good. Andrea, then we go with Christian. Uh, number three. Uh -huh. Catherine is Canadian. 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 Mm -hmm. um, y le, la puedo contestar negativa. No. It's a, no porque te dice que Catherine es canadiense. Es, entonces es, so am I. Yes, yeah, so am I. No puede decir Catherine es canadiense. Yo tampoco. No, yo también. Okay, no está inventando, Andrea. Okay, so next, what's next? Christian. Okay, and the last person will be Susie. Uh, number five. Mm -hmm. Lucy doesn't come early in the morning. Okay. Uh, sería neither do I. Perfect. Okay, Susie. Ok, seven, eh, obvio, es la única. Dan, <risa> Dan lives in Madrid. Ajá. Um, sería su... So do I. Yes, so do I. Perfect. <risa> Good. Ok, I'm going to check the attendance list and we finish. Eh, solo recuerden, please, terminen las tareas ahora o mañana antes de las 8 de la mañana. Please, please, porque ahora yo empiezo a pasar las notas. Y solo un caso extremo, mañana a las 8 de la mañana. ¿Ok? Ok. Pónganos 10. Es que yo solo tengo que pasar la nota. No lo puedo poner. Ese sería maño. Y si hay maño. Ok. Voy a fallar. Okay. En la NEC. 
Sí, por, por andar ahí de, de corrupto. Ah, así que devuelvo lo robado. Ok. So, Alberto Sereno, no. Andrea Vázquez. I'm here. Ya te vi. Carmen, I know she's busy. Eh, César. Um, ok. Oh, Claudia. Present. Ok. Christian. Present. Thank you. Alexander. Present teacher. Good. Diana. It's me. Yes, it's you. Dora. Present. Good. Ok. Ever. No. José, no. José Fajardo, no. José Miguel, maybe. She's at home. She's at home. She's at home. José Miguel. Present. Ok, good. Carla. Thank you, José Miguel. I'm here. Good. Ok, Kelvin. Hello. Present teacher. Good. Leslie. Present teacher. Good. Uh, Marlon. Present. Nice. Nancy. Present. Very good. Susie. Present. Nice. And Judith. Ok, my friends. Present. See you. Descansen. Thank you, Judith. Descansen todo lo que puedan y si no trabajen. Y yes. después el domingo descansan. Terminen la tarea, please. No se atrasen. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, so I'm waiting for the student that he told me that he was going to be here. So I'm going to wait for a couple of seconds. So uh, just to have like a review of what we started um, today in the class, here we have vocabulary practice. It's the class number 15, uh, beginner model number one. We started how to use prepositions of time. In this case, uh, here we have three options, on, in, at. Here we have on Saturday, and here also have on January, on Monday, February 5th, on Wednesday morning. Also here we have in, in May, in 2018, in the summer, in the morning, or here we have at, at 2.30, at noon, at night, and at midnight.
we have the, the exercise number five from the manual. Uh, the instruction says, complete uh, the email using prepositions of time. Compare answers with a classmate. So here we have uh, from Patty and uh, 2018 at email.com to Mary underscore two at email.com. Subject new products presentation. So it says, Hello, Fatima. Are you busy on Monday afternoon? Do you know about the new product uh, that the company launches? There's a presentation about it and it sounds very interesting. It starts at 6.30. I work until 5.45, but I can meet you at six on the corner or First Avenue and Main Street. What do you think? There's another presentation, but it, it will be on uh, in March on Sunday, and I can't that day. During the class, also the students had a uh, prayer practice in which they had to create six questions by using these words what, when, where, why, which, who. So um, they could ask to, well, to different people about personal information. Then we have a review of the areas in our in a, in an enterprise, for example, production, research and development, purchasing, marketing, human resources management, accounting, and finance. So they had to unscramble the letters. Number one is production. Number two is purchasing. Number three is human resources management. And here we have number two, research and development. Number four, uh, marketing. Number six, six, accounting and finance. And finally, we have uh, this uh, speaking activity, which was interview a partner about his or her activities on a typical day at work, using information, questions, and prepositions of time. So they had to fulfill this chart by um, taking into account activities that they do during, uh, during a typical day at work. So in the morning, they had to express the routines or the functions that they developed uh, in the enterprise for the other student to take notes and write down the, the information that his classmates uh, mentioned. So this was everything for this class. So see you next week.